many Muslims try to become part of the 9-11 observations by giving blood, a huge blood drive across the country, including a big push in New Jersey. Here's Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles. Giving life is on the hearts of the Ahmadiyya Muslim community on the 10th anniversary of 9-11. To save lives now, whatever anybody else did, whether they were Muslims or not Muslims, but we are for American safety, we are for American lives, we want to save American lives. This is the first year of the Muslims for Life Red Cross blood drive in Clinton, New Jersey. The response is so overwhelming, it's definitely not the last. This is the first year we're doing it because this thought came with the 10th anniversary of that, but now this thought is now alive and we're going to take it to next year and next year. Now this is just one of 250 blood drives being held across the country by the Ahmadiyya Muslim community today. Here in North Jersey, the goal has been set at collecting 200 bags of blood, but nationwide, the goal is set at 10,000. Collecting enough blood to save 30,000 lives is a goal Joanna Juices wants to be part of. It's a great idea. The outlook on the Muslim community since 9-11 has really changed um, and impacted negatively. So I think this is a great way for the Muslim community to say, we want to do something good. And for Jane Susswing, it's a way to honor those who couldn't be saved. But sober, I've lost some friends, and I feel this is a, a very good way to, to uh, spend the day. In Clifton, New Jersey, Darla Miles, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. So many important stories tied to September 11th and its 10th anniversary. And we have had so many Eyewitness News reporters involved. We've done that.